one. So we are going to learn another new poem today and it's called a haiku poem. Now I like it because it's just a funky name anyway. Now a haiku poem is all about syllables. So syllables are different to phonics and phonemes. It's how we chunk words up. For example, dog or cupcake or turtle alligator. Now haiku poems are very short and they're only three lines. Now the reason we need to know about syllables is because there are going to be five syllables in the first line, seven in the second and five again in the third. So there's only three lines but you really have to think about and count out how many syllables before you write your line. So Remember, first line, how many are there? Five. Second line, seven. Third line, five. Now today we're going to create a Who Am I poem. So this is going to be about an animal. I want you to give me some clues about your animal, but don't tell me what it is. And I'm going to have to guess with your haiku poem. So you might want to include some characteristics, its habitat, where it lives, what it eats, if it hibernates, migrates, any details you want. I'm going to give you an example. Now before you write each sentence, you are going to have to either clap out or count out the syllables. If you have too many, you need to make it a shorter sentence. If you don't have enough, you're going to need to make it a longer sentence. Remember, five in the first line, seven in the second, five in the third. I'm going to give you an example of a haiku poem, What Am I? And I want you to have a guess. Okay, are you ready? Now the first line. Green and speckled legs. Can you see how those five syllables? Do we clap it out? Green and speckled legs. Ooh, that was my first line. My next line. Hops on logs and lily pads. Should we do that again? Hops on logs and lily pads. That was seven. Okay, my last sentence. How many syllables does it need to be? Five. Okay. Splash in cool water. Let's clap it out. Splash in cool water. Hmm, do you have any ideas of what my animal is? That's right, it's a frog. Great. Should we have one more go? Okay. So my first line, again, needs to be five syllables. In a pouch I grow. Hmm, in a pouch I grow grow. Five syllables. Now a pouch. Ooh, I'm already having some clues. Now my next line needs to be seven syllables because it's the one in the middle. Let's see if you know. On a southern continent. Hmm. on a southern continent. There's my seven syllables. Now my last one. Can you remember how many? Five. If you haven't already got it, I hope this is the clue. Can jump very high. Hmm. Can jump very high. Do you have an idea of what it could be? That's right, it's a kangaroo. Well done. So now it's your turn. Remember, haiku poems are only three lines. So before you write each line, you have to clap it out to make sure that it is five syllables for the first line, seven for the second, and five for the last one. And if you need to, don't change the whole sentence around. Sometimes you can make lines shorter by taking some words away or changing the word. So I would like you to have a go. 
creating a haiku poem, What Am I? Using an animal of your choice. I can't wait to see your haiku poems. Bye guys. Thank you.